So here we are in the women's bathroom, and I know that's a little strange to be filming in a women's room, and the camera guy is a guy, but it's important to know that we have these low flow fixtures installed. And this was done in 2008, and combined with all of that, we've saved 800,000 gallons of water. The Green Team was established in 2006, uh, really as a way to align the passion of our community towards sustainability. So when I come down, people will laugh and ask, who's the pregnant woman picking the trash? But um, a lot of people will come up and it just gives them awareness that, oh, where do I throw this? So many times I'll be here sorting the trash and people will come up with their plastic containers and say, oh, I didn't even know this. It does drive me crazy throwing it in the trash but I didn't know that we could put it recycling. So one of the monthly initiatives for the green team is uh, promoting alternative forms of transportation. So faculty member Jenny Thompson, who's one of the members on the green team, um, actually bikes to work every day no matter what the weather is. Um, so not only does she help promote that kind of initiative, um, she really lives it as well. Okay, well I'm, on the, I'm a faculty member on the green team and um, I mean I think it's really important that, like every single small thing we can do to help um, keep things green is good so I don't have a car, I just cycle everywhere. Rain or shine, I'm always going to cycle for the green team. Whenever I have batteries that have run out, I bring them here and drop them into the battery recycler. That way it keeps them from going into the trash. And um, there's one located here at the operations office. There's also a battery recycler on the third floor of Gutman in the computer lab. And here at HTSC, we like to recycle inkjet cartridges. So all you need to do is take your old inkjet cartridge, put it in the box, take the mailing label and fill it out, slap it on the box and bring it on down here to the mail room where they have this handy box, place it inside, and UPS will come and pick it up and send it back to the manufacturer for recycling. Easy as pie. It's one of our recent initiatives of the Green Team was filtered water. Um, so we heard from students and different staff members on campus that if we can reduce using, um, buying bottled water, you know, and having all those bottles go into landfills, it would be great if we could get people to use more reusable mugs or, or water bottles. Um, I drink the filtered tap water here. Um, Boston and Cambridge tap water is super clean. On top of that, this is uh, filtered water, um, so it's great. Delicious. So this is all of our free cycle stuff. We collect it year-round. We have um, the year-round collection and operations, and this is where we store it all. We have the annual free cycle event every fall. Facilities maintenance operations uses organic landscaping whenever possible. And what that usually means is that they're usually using little or no fertilizer, uh, low water consumption plants, and they normally will mulch or compost all of the uh, debris and uh, grass clippings that they pick up. So it's from the dean through the students that everybody cares about this and, and it shows in everything that we're doing, right? Uh, and, and that's where it becomes, uh, it becomes powerful. So composting is a big thing at the university and we've recently implemented that at HGSC. Um, and the green team's been really researching this for a while now and seeing how can we logistically get it in place here. So we are currently ordering um, composting bins and we're going to revamp this whole thing to make it clear and to have a whole community-wide composting program which has actually started in the back already. This is the composting bin. We have the TOC staff, Tables of Content staff, uh, behind the scenes in the cafe composting all the food scraps and all the compostable products. The Green Team's passion, it, it's really, uh, the Green Team is more than just the eight members on the team. Uh, those are the folks that go out there and help us, you know, uh, carry the message. It's the community. Everybody, everywhere, every day is, is doing the little things uh, that collectively have a huge impact.